Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. Today we are on a ridiculous e-bike. The Anioki A8 Pro Max Dual Motor. This thing has everything. And today's video is just gonna be initial ride. It's not a review. And by the way, stay tuned till the end because I do have a code at the end that you guys can use to save some money off of this. And if you use that link, you get a free air fork upgrade with this bike and additional free accessories. So stay tuned until the end of the video. I'm gonna tell you guys all about that and how you guys can save some money and get some upgrades on this insane bike. Um, when Anioka reached out to me to review this thing, I was super pumped. I'm like, hell yeah, I wanna review this thing. In fact, I like this thing so much, I think I'm gonna keep it and turn it into one of those like motorcycle cruisers. Because this thing already goes so fast, you've probably seen a lot of videos about this bike already. It goes over 40 miles an hour, it has a ton of power. It's crazy, it has giant brakes, dual motors, huge battery. Most of these bikes come with a 20, maybe a 25 amp hour battery, maybe 30 amp hours. This thing is like 30 amp hours, let's double it. 60 amp hours, 52 volts, which means that the motors are gonna go faster, give you more, oh, give you more speed, give you higher RPM. This bike is just, it's just an animal. I don't even know what, to, what else to call it. It's just monstrous. It's so heavy because it has everything. And right now we're at battery percentage 46. And you can already tell that this thing is gonna give you some serious speed. Look at this. Even at 46% battery, we're getting almost 40 miles an hour. Unbelievable. There it is, there's 40. Although we are going slightly downhill. Now we're really going downhill. And I'll tell you what, the air fork plus the dual suspension in the back does make this thing feel very firmly planted along with the weight of this bike because this is a very heavy bike. I think it's uh, like around 130 pounds, maybe more. We'll try the, uh, the hill test maybe, why not? If it doesn't make it, we're gonna obviously come back here and do it again with full battery charge, but why not try it out? Here we go, battle assist five, sport mode. Uh, I don't know, I don't know what's gonna happen. You know what, let's actually, let's actually make it fair. Let's start at the base. Okay, here we go, three, two, one, go. All right, it did it. So even at 45% battery, less than half charge, this bike climbed the nearly inconquerable hill. That, ladies and gentlemen, is one of the reasons why I'm excited about this bike. Some bikes give you power and a medium-sized battery. Some bikes give you a big-sized battery, maybe two batteries, and a medium amount of power, sometimes less. This bike, it, <laughs> it just gives you everything. I, I don't even know what to say about this thing. It gives you everything. It's like... Just take everything. Uh, you know what? I know you guys are all obsessed with 203 millimeter rotors. Let's just give you a rotor the size of a dinner plate on the front wheel. Here you go. Just take it all. Dual suspension, air fork, dual motor, giant battery, a huge rear rack that could probably support... Um, oh, look at this. I, I actually had my blinker on. This thing even has blinkers. Yeah, blinkers too. You got a horn, uh, full twist throttle, nice looking display. This thing is it's just an animal, it's what it is. And um, if you guys are watching this right now, I am currently in Arizona doing uh, some uh, video coverage for another e-bike company. I wanted to do a little bit of quick filming just to get you guys some footage for the week that I'm away. So if you're seeing this video, I am currently in Arizona. Uh, but yeah, this bike is coming up in the full review. Stay tuned for that. Let's keep riding around. The front wheel does like to spin. Let's bring it down to level one so we don't uh, spin out too much. Ah, it still spins in level one. This is a, this thing is just a tank. A little faster, level two. Oh, got a cricket on my leg. This field is starting to get overgrown and gotta watch out for ticks. Even at level one, a little bit of slippage. Ready? If we start level one, yeah, still slipping. And if we go from level five, Tons of wheel slip, tons of power. Wow. The air forks on this bike are very, very nice. Very soft, lots of travel. Um, we're going to talk about this later in the review. The bike has a lot of weight, so when you do brake, the whole bike leans forward. And that's okay. That's all right. You can tighten up the suspension by adding more air 
or adjusting the compression. Yeah, this thing is insane. Uh, I've never been on a bike with just uh, this much battery, <laughs> with this much power, this much brakes, this much everything. Uh, Andy Oki, I don't know how they're making any money on this thing. They were just like, you know what, let's just give them everything. The brakes feel good. Obviously, the, uh, the giant rotor is going to help you stop on a dime. Just a ton of leverage. Watch, going downhill. It's, it's, it's ridiculous. This bike is, uh, is insane. In fact, it's so insane. This is one of the bikes that I actually want to keep and further modify. I love the power of this bike. We're not going to change anything with the power, but we will maybe throw on some ape hangers, a more comfortable seat, and turn this thing into a, like a cruiser chopper kind of thing. I don't know. You guys let me know in the comments. What do you think of that idea? Sidewalk of doom. That front fork is uh, really working hard. The rear suspension seems to feel pretty good as well. No problem with the sidewalk of doom. Initial impressions on the throttle. There is a little bit of delay. And what else is annoying, and this is something I saw from uh, Mr. Central Driver's earlier video, is that there's also a delay when you let go of the throttle. So here we go. Throttle power let go and it goes for a split second it still keeps going it's something that you probably can eventually get used to but uh it's there you know it's there you will notice it hopefully that along with only other minor issues are the only issues that this bike will have we'll do the full review we're doing this initial ride just to uh kind of bed the brakes and see what else needs to be adjusted before we do the full review and if those minor issues are the only ones that persist throughout the life of the bike, this could be an extremely high value bike, especially considering it comes with, it, it just gets, you just get everything. And what else I have for this bike is I have the Anioki inverter that plugs in where you can use the battery to charge stuff at home, to run stuff at home. Like the output of that inverter, I want to say is a thousand watts. I can run my entire refrigerator from this e-bike battery. And I did take the battery of the single motor Anioki and the inverter camping at one time. And I used that battery for a bunch of stuff, charged up a bunch of things. We, we even joked around saying next time I should just bring a TV. And I do even have solar panels. They're not Anioki solar panels, but I do have solar panels that I can hook up into the inverter and charge this battery. So this bike, uh, not only does it give you everything, you can use it for more than e-bike stuff. You can run appliances from the battery, and you can charge the battery with solar if you get the inverter from Anioki's website. I'm sure you guys can figure out how to wire up some other kind of inverter as well if you wanted to. A lot of the inverters nowadays, they come with a battery pre-installed in them. And Anioki's inverter, they just use this battery. And it seems like there's more robust parts inside to handle higher current, higher wattage output. So we'll see. This bike, um, this, this thing is just amazing. I like the seating position as well. Very comfortable, more upright position. So if you use the link in the description below and my coupon code, not only is it going to save you $50 off this bike, but you will also get the air fork upgrade for free. In addition to that, you're also going to get a free cargo basket, a free mirror, and a free lock. Using that link will help support the channel at no extra cost to you. Thank you guys who are using my links. I really do appreciate it. It does mean a lot to me. It helps me make more videos like this. But yeah, guys, that's the initial preview of the Anioki A8 Pro Max dual motor, which seemingly has everything. It, this thing just has everything, all the power, all the battery. You get all the accessories using my link. This thing is an animal and I cannot wait till I get back and I'm able to do the full review on this thing. That's it for today, folks. Until next time.